My name is Poppy and I love doing science experiments. Hi, as it's Easter soon, you'll probably be going to have a lot of these around your house, either for eating or rolling. If you're looking for something different to try, why not use them to show the difference between physical change and a chemical change? So, what is the difference between a physical and chemical change? A physical change is a change in substance that can be reversed, such as freezing and melting water. But a chemical change produces an entirely new substance and it, is can and it cannot be reversed like burning a piece of wood. Let's take a look at what this means using my two eggs. Let's start with the real egg. As I heat the egg, it will start to cook. Now that egg is cooked, I cannot change it back. This means it's a chemical change. Let's take a look at what happens when we heat the chocolate. As I heat the chocolate, it should, it should stop the melt. Oops, I've managed to burn it. There's no way I can turn this back into chocolate. I guess that makes it a chemical change too. Let's try this again, but this time I'm going to melt it over some water. That's more like it. As you can see, I've got some nice runny chocolate. But this time I can turn it back into a solid by letting the chocolate cool down. As you can see, I now have solid chocolate again. This makes this a physical change, and a very tasty one at that. Thanks for watching, and if you enjoyed this video, please remember to like and subscribe. Bye!